the third game in 12 days, kind of how are you getting ready for it? Um, you know, I think we've been through the toughest part of it, just to, you know that four game, that four day stretch where we had to turn around and play. But uh, you know, we're back on a regular schedule. We got seven days to prepare for the next game, and uh, I think we're good. I think we're ready. What are your impressions of Dak, the runner? Do you have any tips for him? Be curious at all. Um, just keep doing what he's doing, man. He's doing pretty good. <laughs> what do you think of a stiff arm the other day? Uh, it was average. <laughs> <laughs> What have uh, you seen out of the Vikings' run, D? I mean, they, they're they a very good team, and they're good at what they do. Uh, they don't do a lot of different things. They uh, kind of stick to what they do, and they don't really change because they're good at it. So, I mean, they're very sound. They don't really lose gaps. They, uh, I mean, they just they don't, don't, they don't make mistakes. So it's just going to come down to execution. Looking back, how much progress have you made just in the way that you, you gel with the offensive line and, and how close are you? You with those guys? Uh, a lot has changed since week one. You know, I've become a lot more patient of a runner. I became a lot more comfortable with the system, and uh, I think we're gelling very good right now. I uh, think we're a real close group. Uh, we work together. We we complement each other with uh, our physical play, and uh, it just it works out really good. It's been a pretty consistent trend, Zeke. A little tougher earlier in the game, and then you know it always seems to end up somewhere in the 90s for the total 20 whatever carries. You talk a lot about wearing people down and stuff like that. I mean, is it that, or is there something else to it that you think just where you just kind of end up with those pretty consistent numbers? Um, I mean, I think yeah, it's just wearing them down. You know, uh, teams are going to come out and try to stop the run. They know that's what we want to do. We want to come out and establish the run. So. They're gonna come out and try to stop it, but as the game goes goes on and on, we wear them down, and uh, the, the smaller runs get bigger and bigger. Are they doing the same things scheme-wise in the third and fourth quarter that they do early? And you all, it is just a matter of wearing them down. Do you, you kind of see the same thing late? Yep. How things change the, when you guys not running 12 as much as you've done tr traditional 12, I guess. And you bringing in Joe Moore, you're doing more with your fullbacks and things like that. Yeah, and Maley's been in there a little bit. Has anything changed with how much you guys do or what you guys do out of certain run looks without Jeff Swain? No. <laughs> Zeke, talk about Dak's uh, composure in the fourth quarter, and, and it seems like he just gets better, especially in crunch time. I uh, mean, uh, we've talked about it before. He's a pro, you know, he smiles in the face of adversity. Uh, you know, he never never loses cool, and uh, I mean, that's one of his best best things about him. You know, no matter what's what's happening in the game, you know, he's gonna keep going out there and playing like, like 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 it's, it's a regular down. And so, I mean, I think that's that's uh, very good. Is that easier said than done sometimes, though, especially in the fourth quarter? Um, you know, I think it is, but you know, we're, we're competitors. Uh, this, this is why we play ball. We play ball to be in moments like that, and so, you know, we we, we kind of enjoy that. Coach Herman getting the Texas you know, you know, it's, it's, it's good to see him doing well. It's good, it's good to see him, you know, get, getting those those shots, you know, and uh, I think he'll I think he'll do great up there. Did you have time to watch the Ohio State game yesterday? Well, I watched bits and pieces. Impressions of the win over time? Uh, you know, anytime you win that game, it's a big win. So happy for my Buckeyes, man. Hopefully they're getting, getting that uh, playoff. Third first down? Huh? Is it a first down? Yeah. <laughs> Aren't they in? They're in, right? Uh, I mean, the final one, Rangers haven't come out yet, so <laughs> you never know. I was asking about the offensive line earlier. You know, Terrence Smith is kind of a man of few words around us. I mean, do, have you, do you guys have a relationship? I mean, do you, do you talk to him a lot off the field? And what's he, what are you two like with each other, I guess? Uh, I mean... He's a man of few words with everyone. <laughs> that's just that's just the type of guy he is. So I mean, I mean we're close. We're all a close group. This whole team is close.